hey guys, I just got done with a pretty hard workout. It's really hot here in Burbank. It's about 100 degrees today. And I just wanted to hop on here and share something with you because I was really struggling to get myself to work out. And I had a lot of story attached to that. I've been really frustrated with um, letting myself get out of shape and, and then really judgmental about that. And uh, so I put my focus onto a lot of other things that I could be proud of. Meanwhile, just letting myself continue to sit in this story of being frustrated with, with not being as in good of shape as I used to be. And, um, you know, not being as strong. And it's really gotten to a point lately where there's all these things I'm really excited about learning how to do and just being more adventurous. And I wanna learn how to rock climb and surf. And those things really scare me because I know the strength I need to be able to do those. Um, not not just mental, I mean like physical strength. There's there's definitely, I wanna be stronger so that I can just take on any adventure and any challenge. And the, the more, like the more I don't do those things, the more I'm wrapped up in this story of that I can't that I can't do those things. Which is, you know, for a life coach is kind of a crappy feeling. But that's why I wanted to share this with you because this is an area of one of my struggles. And it it was brought up to me today, actually today, a very wise coach told me um, that the reason people stay stuck is because they make it personal. They get you know, instead of making progress and, and making change, they stay stuck because they make it all about them. And, and you know, the, well, why am I here? And how did I let myself get to here? And like, what's wrong with me? And so there's all this judgment wrapped up in me not being as in shape as I used to be. And, and I was reminded too that before I got into shape a few years ago, I wasn't. <laughs> like, as in, like before I could do a push up, I couldn't. And the only way that I was able to do a push up was by getting stronger and just doing it. When I was first learning how to do that, there wasn't nearly as much judgment. There was excitement. There was passion for like getting stronger. And now, I, when I work out now, I get frustrated that I'm, I can remember like how strong I used to be and I'm not now. And so I get kind of angry during my workouts. And so then that just keeps me from working out altogether because I'm like so mad at myself. And that judgment just keeps me in this, this uh, cycle that gets me nowhere. And so the question today that was posed to me was that if I took my story out of it, if I took all this judgment and pain and uncomfortability I feel away from that, what would I do in this moment? Not what would I do tomorrow or what would I do the rest of the week or what would I do to, to get fit or to do these things? What would I do right now? And the answer was I would just work. I would just work out. Actually, I said I would go for a hike, but it's 100 degrees out, so I didn't. I worked out inside in the air conditioning instead, and I'm still this hot and sweaty. But for a moment, it felt easy. I mean, the workout wasn't easy, and I still had the frustration. I was still bummed that... You know, I could only do a couple push-ups and like full push-ups. Um, the rest had to be on my knees and I didn't last very long even there. And that really bums me out because that's not what it used to be like. And I got tired so easily and, but now I'm done. And I took a step today that I wouldn't have taken if I'd stayed wrapped up in my story. And so tomorrow there'll come a, a choice again. There'll come a moment where I can be in my story and I can stay in, I can stay there and be judgmental of myself for being in this place now, or I could just appreciate the fact that this is where I am right now. And um, I can just, I can stay in the story and keep not making progress, or I can just take steps. I can just take steps every day, every moment, take the action by taking my story out of it, making it less personal, and just do what I know I need to do so that I can take these adventures. I have, I have so many like things I want to do and I don't want my lack of strength and ability to be the reason or physical ability to be the reason I can't do them. Um, so anyway, I thought, you know, that might be a story that some of you could relate to about keeping being stuck and it's a new idea for me and, and, and I pose that to you. Like what would happen if you take the st your story out of it, if you make it, don't make it personal keep all of that out of what what would the answer be what would you do and how might that affect the action you take now
All right. Thanks. Have a great day. Bye.